Revelation 14, 2 through 5. And I heard a voice from heaven, as the voice of many waters, and as the voice of a great thunder. And I heard the voice of harpers harping with their harps. And they sung as it were a new song before the throne, and before the four beasts and the elders. And no man could learn that song, but the hundred and forty-four thousand which were redeemed from the earth. These are they which were not defiled with women, for they are virgins. These are they which follow the Lamb, whithersoever he goeth. These were redeemed from among men, being the first fruits unto God and to the Lamb. And in their mouth was found no guile, for they are without fault before the throne of God. The 144,000 sing a new song of worship and redemption. The four beasts and elders are the same as in chapter 4. That the 144,000 were virgins and not the bottle of women may indicate either literally celibacy and sexual purity or figuratively moral and religious purity, refusal to submit to the false religious system of the false prophet. They follow the lamb and reign with him. As the first fruits of the redeemed, they are the first to be saved during the tribulation period, following the rapture of the church of Revelation 7, 1 through 4. A characteristic of the redeemed is that they are without guile or falsehood. This may refer to their rejection of the false claims of the Antichrist concerning himself. That they are without fault or blemish means that they are ethically blameless.